Hello friends, welcome again in my video tutorial. Today I will uh, do something different. I will be not show you some uh, brewing methods or some brewing tips, but I will do review of my or first touch of my new coffee grinder. I cannot say review. This one I will do maybe later after a couple of weeks when I will use. And um, this one it's my second uh, time or coffee grinder. I used to have before uh, like one of this first version with a wooden bottom. After three years I decided to change and buy a new one. Uh, this one is uh, approximate weight. Uh, it's not too fancy and stylish like this old one but has some small improvements and um, of course sharp uh, knives or blades. Let's go open this box. This box, uh, at, uh, this cheaper version, it's not too fancy, kind of like um, uh, elegant, like it, uh, at uh, this more expensive, which is not a coffee grinder, but has a better uh, back, what I remember from older one, some manuals, warranty list, and uh, you have handle, and Alan coffee grinder. These new versions of coffee grinders from Timor they have as well brush for cleaning. This uh, old one I remember they didn't have in box. This one is already updated, second generation of this um, coffee grinder, which is not. Uh, C2 uh, has uh, a metal bottom, this old one has plastic one. Um, what I like, uh, this bottom it's possible to scroll, and this wooden one you can just uh, pull it and sometimes open it uh, during uh, coffee grinding alone and I lost some coffee grinds from this. Uh, what has different from this more expensive, it's this uh, plastic uh, inside it. Uh, this old one has aluminium. And uh, setting it same, uh, generally up or down, depend uh, on what kind of um, uh, grinding do you want, if you want coarser or finer. Uh, this handle, it's uh, as well a uh, steel one, not uh, this uh, per generation I think had plastic one. Uh, this um, material it's kind of like a little bit rough in hands but there will be not slip and it's easy to screw back and travel with this grinder. To this grinder it's possible to fit uh, 25 uh, grams of coffee beans, so we can try. But I don't like stride way, it's that it does not uh, fit the, the, for example from Aeropress. But still, I can manage. To this top part, it's so so. So let's go try first. I don't know what it's set up there, but they are only tasting beans, so I don't mind. Probably something very, very fine. Yes. So I will put more cursor. Probably. It 
This voice can be more like a little bit uh, annoying. Mostly that you can wake up somebody else. So now it's a little bit better. I'm grinding for filter. You'll see when I'm grinding, I'm using both hands, left and right, and I'm going opposite direction with both. This one is helping me a lot, um, and power, and it's easier uh, grind. Mainly when uh, these bins are more lighter. I do like this um, grinders like hand uh, hand grind, hand grind. I think or um, this older version, but you have to stable on table and. Uh, push them hard and uh, using just power of one hand uh, this way if you will move uh, left and uh, right hand you can uh, use much stronger power and easier grind for this reason I decided to go for timer it's a good exercise for every morning but uh, this is a grinding it's much more uh, easier than with uh, grinding with ceramic uh, uh, blades or uh, um, with stones. Uh, the steel one, uh, they cutting this um, copy uh, beans and as well crushing, so uh, I think I think it's better. These uh, ceramic stones, they're just uh, uh, crushing, not too much uh, cutting. So 25 grams, it's probably maximum what can hold this uh, coffee grinder, but it's the depends on, uh, of um, coffee beans, some are smaller and uh, more heavier, so you can maybe fit even 30 grams, this one was kind of like a regular size. This uh, ball, small ball, will benefit all 25 grams. So I'll just show you some. This grinding is very consistent and nice. You don't feel a big uh, difference. I think for this price, approximately 80 euro, what I spend, it's not too bad. Uh, grinder, uh, sure will be very happy. And uh, it's not very heavy for traveling. You can easily pack to uh, package and uh, back and bring somewhere. So um, I hope that you enjoy it. This first touch with uh, Tamur uh, coffee grinder. And soon I will come in with some review of this coffee grinder and uh, my feelings and uh, more experience and I can compare with this uh, more expensive version of coffee grinder from Timer. I think what it's cost around 150, 160 euro. And I will say oh, it was worth it uh, to pay more or just uh, pay less and has kind of like same effect, same uh, work like it is more expensive thank you again and uh, see you soon